Visualizing categorical actuals versus target data is often done in a column chart, but personally I find these slow to interpret, not to mention sometimes you might want to also include a stretch target or a forecast, and by then it's just too tedious to read. Let's look at some ways we can enhance the boring old column chart and make it something that's quick and easy to read, you know, the way charts should be. Let's start by transforming this two series column chart into something more like a thermometer chart. I'm going to duplicate this chart, I've just selected it and then Control D to duplicate and that way we can compare the two charts side by side. First I want to select the target series and then I'm going to Control 1 to open the format data series pane. The first thing I want to do is set the series overlap to 100% and then in the paint bucket tab I'm going to set the fill to no fill and I want the border to be a dark blue and let's increase the width to one and a half. Now immediately we can see which managers are above or below target. I think you'll agree it's quicker and easier to interpret than the regular column chart on the left. But what happens if you have three series, like this chart with the actual target and stretch target? Again, I'll duplicate the chart so we can compare them side by side. First, I want to select the target series and control one to open the format data series pane. I'm going to set the overlap to 100% and then let's format it with no fill and we'll set the border the same as the previous one. And I'll just select the actual series. Now, if you're having trouble selecting series, you can always go up to the format tab and then in the drop down here, you can select the series that you want. So I want to format the actual series just with a lighter shade of blue and we'll just choose solid fill just to help with the contrast. Next, I want to make the stretch series into a dash line. So I first need to select it. Let's use this technique up here so we can be sure we've got the right series. And I want to change the chart type. So up in the design tab, we're going to change chart type. And in here, we want the stretch series to be the line with markers. And I'll click OK. Now all I need to do is format the line so that there's no line. And then let's format the marker. In marker options, we want the built-in dashed line. I'm going to increase the size to 14. And then let's set the fill to a darker shade so it stands out. I'm going to set it to the same shade as the target. Let's do the same for the border for the marker. Now you could set the marker shade to a different color if you prefer, but since they're both targets, it makes sense to leave them as the same color and let the marker itself differentiate the series. So there's our new chart. Again, we can more easily compare the three series at a glance. I hope you can make use of this technique. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more. Thanks for watching.